This is a 1934 and a half uh, Dodge four-door sedan. The book I have uh, suggested that the uh, half-year models were noted for the fewer slats on the uh, side of the hood, only four, as compared to the earlier 34 models that had more slats. Notice the suicide doors. And notice the prominent uh, ram there on the uh, on the front of the uh, car on the top of the uh, radiator. You'll also see the uh, windshield is popped out for ventilation. There are prominent horns out front. The color I would say is a very light uh, tan. It's minus the windshield wipers that would be above the windshield. Very prominent running boards, and you see both the front and back doors are suicide doors. Now this car is uh, original, so imperfections are here. Notice the delaminated uh, glass, and uh, the interior is is really original. It's amazing. It's like uh, walking back through a time machine. Now take a look at the dash and it's very stylized, beautiful instrument cluster. Notice how the gauges form a uh, figure very similar to the speedometer there, matched. Beautiful. There you see the crank for the windshield. And the pattern of the upholstery on the door is definitely original. As the owner said, a car is only original once. Once you start changing things, then you're getting away from its uh, the way it appeared over the years. When you spot this car on the street, this is what it would look like. These cars had a six-cylinder engine. Uh, 218 cubic inches. Notice that the vent in the back opens out and there are vents in the front. And the book said that there was another model that Dodge introduced that uh, saved a little money by not having the vents there in the front, in the front doors. They're very conscious about cost.